We start with a new lawsuit against the Union School District in San Jose. KPI X Files Maria Medina live at Dartmouth Middle School with the case that launched this lawsuit. Maria? And this was the lawsuit filed more than a year after Samuel Knipe was arrested. He was arrested not because the school notified police, but because the alleged victim came forward. I would describe him as a serial predator, a very dangerous man. Samuel Knipe is accused of sexually abusing a 13-year-old girl soon after he was hired at Dartmouth Middle School in 2008. In 2010, a parent told school staff Knipe was sending inappropriate texts to her daughter, including, the only girl I want anything to do with is you, and that he hugged her and kept meeting with her alone. That same year, he was promoted and tenured. In 2013, another parent reported Knight texted her daughter nearly 400 times. The school district did not report the conduct. They weren't protecting the students at all. They were just kind of like sweeping it under the rug. Instead, they say school staff conducted its own investigation, warned Knight to stop texting his students, and told him to keep the case confidential. In 2014, Knight then allegedly began sexually abusing another 13 year old girl. He, in fact, actually had a camera. To detect people coming into the classroom. Since school districts, at least in this area, have shown that they cannot do this, we are going to ask the courts to do it for them. In their lawsuit, the lawyers are demanding the Union School District ban teachers from using social media and cell phones to communicate with students, copy parents on emails to students, remove locks from offices, and deny one on one meetings with students. Violations would result in suspension without pay or termination. My kids. Thought he was a hero. Knipe was popular and well liked, but they say that was all part of his grooming process. They say teachers shouldn't just be punished after the sexual assault, but before it even begins. Knipe is just one of several teachers in San Jose arrested in the last couple of years for allegedly sexually abusing students. If you can't prevent the grooming and know what to look for, you're never going to prevent the sexual assault. And the superintendent released a statement tonight through an attorney saying in part, quote, after Mr. Knipe's arrest, the district immediately placed him on an administrative leave. Administration, teachers and staff will continue to work toward ensuring that every one of our students feels safe at school. Now, we asked the superintendent for an on-camera interview, but we were given the statement. Instead, Knipe remains in custody. Live in San Jose, Maria Medina, KPIX 5. All right, Maria, thank you.